Konstantin Daniel Rosenthal was a Jewish-Austrian-Romanian painter and sculptor, born in Pest, Hungary in 1820. He unfortunately passed away at a young age on July 23, 1851. Rosenthal was an artist who was heavily influenced by the art movement of Romanticism. He was known for his portraits and his choice of Romanian Romantic nationalist subjects. Despite his short career, his works had a lasting impact. Rosenthal was not affiliated with any specific painting school, but rather worked independently. Rosenthal was influenced by European Romanticism and drew inspiration from various sources, including literature and music. He was friends with notable figures such as Franz Liszt and Mikhail Kogalnesianu. Despite his relatively brief body of work, he is considered an important figure in the Romanian artistic legacy. From 1820 to 1839, Constantine Daniel Rosenthal, born into a Jewish merchant family in Pest, attended the Vienna Academy of Fine Arts where he studied archaeological drawing. He made his first Romanian acquaintance, painter Johan D. Nigulasai. After finishing his studies, he arrived in Wallachia's capital, Bucharest around 1842, where he probably began a long series of boyar portraits. Rosenthal was introduced to liberal radical circles by Nigulasai and became close to C. Rossetti. He left for France in late 1844 to improve his oil painting technique and began attending meetings of Wallachian and Moldavian students expressing nationalist and radical ideals. He was accompanied by Rossetti, who praised Rosenthal's work ethic. In 1846, Rosenthal visited England with the profit he gained from his artistic works. Upon his return to Paris, he learned of his family's financial distress and left for Budapest in early 1847, only to go to Mehadia and then to Bucharest. Here, he joined radical circles as a member of the secret society Freysia, which was then concealing itself as a literary society presided by Ayanku Vacarescu. He was commissioned by Vasile Alexandri to paint the deceased Elena Negri's portrait after a daguerreotype. He also painted the portrait of Anna Kamanu, wife of Aga Ayan Kamanu. In June 1848, Rosenthal applied for Wallachian citizenship after the provisional government took hold and was granted it, given his talent and his active participation in the revolution. He was assigned to design a triumphal arch in Bucharest, which was intended to mark the revolution's success. He was also probably assigned to create a Statue of Liberty, although this project only survives in a watercolor by Theodore Amman, Desrobaria Tiganelor, The Freeing of the Gypsies. Most radicals were arrested and exiled in various locations after Ottoman troops intervened against the revolution later that year, but because he carried an Austrian passport, Rosenthal was spared. When the revolutionaries were being transported, he unsuccessfully requested to join them, but later he managed to convince the Austrian mayor to disarm the Ottoman guards and allow the prisoners to go free. In conclusion, Konstantin Daniel Rosenthal was a talented painter with a strong influence from Romanticism. Despite his short life, his works had a lasting impact on the art world. Rosenthal worked independently and was not affiliated with any specific painting schools. He had a strong connection with Romania and drew inspiration from literature and music, as seen in his choice of Romanian Romantic nationalist subjects. Though his career was brief, Rosenthal is considered an important figure in the Romanian artistic legacy.